All right, it's Chun Chun here, and for today's topic, gonna talk about how to avoid and handle real estate dispute or what you say conflict actually. And when you step into investing real estate, especially for land deal or doing something project, so the dispute sure will happen or conflict sure will happen, uh, but you can avoid it or minimize it. If you have followed these kind of tips that can help you actually. So. Straight to the point, how to do it? The first is when you go and find a deal, actually you're gonna work work with a good experienced broker or real estate agent. So that the kind of agent you want you want to find an agent actually is the agent actually is they know you and they actually know what you want and they will go and find a great deal for you and not just simply you you gonna avoid the agent that they come in front of you just they just trying hard to hard selling you. You don't want that kind of agent. Actually, you want the agent that actually have the journey hurt. They actually they want to help you actually, and they can help you to find a great deal for you and provide a great opportunity for you. You want that kind of agent or real estate broker to work with you. So after that, you are gonna consult with a good experienced lawyer early on. You can hire a lawyer before before you step into a deal because this will help you to save a lot of time and money because with a great experience, real estate attorney or lawyer, they will tell you early the problem because before you go and face that problem so that you can avoid it, avoid the problem. Not just about the problem when you face some problem or you have some issue happen. They will help you to solve that problem also. You want that kind of real estate lawyer. Actually, this will save you a lot of time, energy, and effort. So, number three is when you come up with a, with, with a deal, you're going to insist a clear contact that protect your interest. And then this one, you can work with your lawyer. So, the fourth is you can carefully specific and limit remedies in the contracts. Everything you must be specific and limit. So the next is you gonna avoid problem people when you go and find a deal. You when you face the people actually is they don't want to communicate out. Yeah, actually, they got some legal issue. Everything else, huh? the kind of people you gonna avoid. Then not just about people, you gonna avoid the problem deals as of the deals that actually everyone can solve it one. The kind of problem even the person cannot tell you for example is you want to purchase any land or at this price but the owner go and owe someone else or owe the bank with this kind of price so but the market price is at here only you cannot purchase it but actually this kind of deal you cannot convert one so for example this kind of deal you know what after that you're gonna do a true due diligence in including legal due diligence you, you must be hard working and working on all the legal stuff before you you go and do any deal to avoid any legal issue that's the thing you're gonna follow and can help you to avoid some dispute but what happened if you actually when you already find a great deal and that one is the best opportunity for you so when this situation happened you can never quit trying to resolve the dispute. So will dispute happen no matter where you are in the process because when you already find that kind of deal that actually you're gonna grab the opportunity. So how to resolve that real estate dispute when you face it? Actually there's some tips so that you can follow. The first is you're gonna consult with an experienced litigation lawyer to avoid any litigation. Litigation actually for you is the last part for you to go because when dispute arise do whatever you can do to work it out there's a women station way to go and handle it or when you don't know how to handle it maybe you can ask for your real estate broker as agent to go and negotiate everything else if you cannot you can try the mediation try mediation or you can hire a mediator to help you go and communicate so can find out a win-win solution for 
your deal, everything happened. If the thing is continue to raise up the dispute, you can maybe can consider arbitration, which means that arbitrator that they can came up with a legal legal solution, everything can make a decision for you. Then there's the next step for you. Then litigation actually is the last resort uh, for you to come up with litigation. Uh, this is the three step first negotiate first med mediation arbitration then last is litigation part because when actually when you find the deal is below the market price and then you know the location anything else is a great opportunity for you so never stop trying to resolve the dispute no matter where you are in the process this is you're gonna know it because like Steven Stallone say life is not how hard you hit it's how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward so at risk the investing not just about you go yourself go and hit it actually you can partner and be teamwork with together with a lot of talent experienced people that can solve your problem so you surround be a team with a people that have talent so you can move on and grab a great deal so hope this will help you in the future or now you can do is see you